now on Live at 4 from food truck to storefront, the popular business that rebuilds after tragedy. Plus, a fuel mishap causes a two-hour delay for passengers at Fresno Yosemite International Airport. A more than 100 gallons were spilled from a plane. And you can expect rain arriving overnight. Also, Madera South High School becomes the first in the state to receive a major recognition. How a new accreditation will benefit students' resumes and set them up for college and careers. ABC 30 Action News Live at 4 starts now. A fresh start after a fiery disaster. It has been more than 18 months since a popular Fresno food truck exploded into flames, injuring two people, including the co-owner. Now Planet Vegan is just days away from opening its own brick and mortar location. Good afternoon, I'm Graciela Moreno. And I'm Dale Yarong. Planet Vegan has risen from the ashes. It is now opening a restaurant in Northwest Fresno after receiving tremendous support from the community. Action News reporter Nico Payne joins us from the new location. He got an inside look at the new digs ahead of opening day this weekend. So we just kind of want to bring the vibes and show love to the city. The positive vibes for Planet Vegan come after a dark and difficult time in June of 2022. An explosion destroyed the popular Fresno. ABC 30 Action News live at 430 starts now. The death toll continues to rise following a mass of 7.6 magnitude earthquake in western Japan. Rescue crews are now rushing to find more survivors. Meantime, teams are struggling to get food and water to severely impacted areas. Good evening and thanks for joining us live at 4.30. I'm Dale Yarong. And I'm Graciela Moreno. Since the massive quake struck yesterday, dozens of aftershocks have been felt, resulting in more blocked roads and landslides. ABC's M. Wynn has a closer look at the devastation. Station. Dale Graziella, thousands have been dispatched to the quake sites, including firefighters, police, and disaster relief. But officials fear they may not be able to reach everyone in need. The race is on to find any survivors trapped under rubble or